I know that you've done some research now on menopausal women. Um, can you tell us a little bit about that study and what was discovered in terms of the hormones sure. and <laughs> metabolic flexibility? If you take the monthly, the monthly cycle of women and you divide it into two, separated by the ovulation, and you look on the first half, pre-ovulation, you see that we tend to um, to you to rely more on carbs to produce energy. Actually, it indicates that we are less flexible, less metabolically flexible in the first half of the cycle. Versus the second half of the cycle, post ovulation, we tend to rely much more on fat stores following an overnight sleep. So we are ten it indicates that we are much more flexible. Now, I think that the nicest thing is that when you try and correlate it in the discussion, okay, but what might be the reason to those metabolic changes? You see how nicely it correlates to progesterone changes during the monthly cycle.